you know, he only played 10 minutes in the first round game against Portland. He had five fouls, played 10 minutes, stepping into the jumper. Kessler Edwards and started games in the ACC at Pitt. Willie really Caruso, runner, too strong. <laughs> you can hear Lorenzo Romar grab the ball. Just a simple instruction. One dribble, three, no good. Well, just a sophomore. He's been playing much better. Uh, and you know, the thing about two, Dave, the aggressive and assertive attacking Pepperdine. Remember, three, they won and out. the first matchup and the only matchup between these two teams. Obi Ross not on the floor. Kessler Edwards, you figure, would be the number one offensive option in that. In particular, a defensive weapon, too, for, for Santa Clara. Yep, that's a big foul call. Kessler Edwards, meanwhile, the blow by with the left hand off the glass. Who seems to be playing his best basketball at the end of the year? Yep. Edwards, three. No, that was a good look. Up off, but now he's got the matchup against the big guy. Ross shoots over top him. A little tap back for the offensive rebound. Here's Edwards, three. Good. That was superb movement without the ball. Kessler Edwards. To the basket, and Brankich missed another one. Players understand. Can you get to your spot and beat the defensive player there? If you can and you can elevate up, you're going to have a really high level of success. Is that pretty or what from Kessler Edwards? Although he fumbled the ball away, I thought he was about to dunk it home. Here's Edwards in transition. No. Williams will try from three. Defenses, he's coming. He's been a pest. It's been hard for Carlisle even to get the ball up the floor. But no matter for Santa Clara, they keep getting good looks around the rim. Gonzaga St. Mary's already slated for one semifinal game. On Monday night from Las Vegas, Kessler Edwards baseline jumper goes down. Love the high release on his shot. You look at this West Coast Conference. You mentioned BYU. They're a lock in the NCAA tournament. This is once again a multi-bid league as Kessler Edwards drops in another three-point shot. Right there. One of two free throws. This day. Edwards. One dribble. Missed the three. Polk, though, hustled. In and out. Long way to go in this one. Pepperdine, Zedek, three. In and out. And now Edwards goes over the back, commits the foul. Four-year starter. At 24, monster game in the second round last night for Santa Clara. Edwards passed up the transition three to get that shot. I love that. I love that. About uh, Kevin Durant is such a great scorer of the basketball. He really dominates a couple of quadrants, in particular to the right and left of the elbow area. Look at that. little shot fake. Stop. Get your feet set underneath you. They have doubled up Pepperdine in the paint. Offensive rebound for Edwards. Chukwuka shoots the three off of it. Pretty quiet game. He's got five and is just two for eight from the floor. Kessler Edwards three. Good. And Edwards with the three. Colby Ross with his tenth assist. They're shooting 50% from the free throw line. Off the inbound play. Kessler Edwards. They left him open and he made him pay. Edwards, he was making a move there. Williams came over with the help defense, got the block shot. No matter what you say about it, hey, these are young kids in great shape. It, it does take a little bit of a toll. Frankich fouled again. Good move against Kessler Edwards. Man, this team, they've got something to it. Now, way short on that one. So still can't find the mark for him. Been a super frustrating game. Williams off to the side, rebound Pepperdine, Kessler Edwards. And Santa Clara is going to back off and not foul. Pepperdine's going to advance to the semifinals and a matchup with the number two seed, BYU, 78 to 70, the final score.